Hey you guys, before we get into this guitar tutorial, I just want to let you know that I created an acoustic guitar worship course. Basically, if you're looking to play the guitar in your worship team, or if you're just looking to learn how to play the guitar from beginning to end based around worship songs, all the songs you already know from church, then uh, you can check it out. I'll go over it more at the end of the lesson. Hi, my name is James Diaz, and today I'm going to teach you how to play The Blessings, the Elevation Worship version of this song with uh, Kariah Job and, and uh, Cardi Kane, Stephen Furter, all those people. I'm going to teach you the chords of this song. I'm going to play the different parts of this song, the verse, the chorus, and the bridge. So you can see where the chords are placed, and then I will teach you a basic strumming pattern that you could use. Um, these chords are a little bit more difficult than than uh, like a G or a C or, or anything like that. We're going to be playing a B chord, F sharp, those kinds of chords. So um, the verses is a B, an E, then you go to a B again, an F sharp, then you're going to do a G sharp minor, And you're going to repeat that. F, B, F sharp, and then instead of ending on a G sharp minor the second time around, you end on a B. So the chords for the verse is a B, an E, a B, an F sharp, and a G sharp minor. Then you do an E, a B, an F sharp, and a B. And the chords for the intro to this song are the exact same chords as the verse. You would play through those chords just like you were playing the verse. Um, for the chords for the chorus, the Amen, it's going to be a G sharp minor, then to an E, then we're going to do a B, and then do an F sharp. And those are the chords. G sharp minor, E, B, F sharp. G sharp minor, E, B, F sharp. And the chords for the bridge are the exact same chords as the chorus, in the exact same pattern. G sharp minor, E, B, F sharp. G sharp minor, E, B, F sharp. So, I'm going to play through the different parts of this song. I'll play the intro, I'll play the verse, I'll play the chorus, and I'll play the bridge, just so you can see where all these chords are placed, and then we'll talk strumming patterns. So. chords go for that. We're going to do the bridge really quick. May his faith
that's basically where all the chords are placed in the song. Now we'll cover a, a basic strumming pattern you could use for this. So a strumming pattern you could use for this is going to be down, up, up, down, 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 up. So down. So that's a basic strumming pattern that you could use for this song. Because that's how you play the blessings, the elevation worship version of that song. Those are the chords that they use. All right, you guys, thank you for watching my guitar tutorial. Again, just want to let you guys know I did create a acoustic guitar worship course specifically for helping people be on their church's worship team. Um, or if you just want to learn how to play the guitar with Christian songs that you already know from church. That's perfect. That's how I learned how to play the guitar. I learned everything online, you know, um, just with all the Christian songs I already knew. So this guitar course will take you from beginning to end, from literally never picking up a guitar. If you're struggling with strumming, if that's difficult for you, I can teach you how to create your own strumming patterns. Instead of just trying to learn somebody else's, I can show you how to make your own. You know, it'll teach you how to transpose songs. It'll teach you how to use a capo, which is really the worship leader's best friend, gotta be honest. Um, it makes everything super simple. It's a very magical tool. It'll teach you everything from learning how to strum, all the chords you need to know, transposing, um, using a capo, how to pick through chords and, and all of those wonderful things. I did some research. So if you pay traditionally to learn how to play the guitar, you go to actual classes and you actually, you know, meet with someone and do all that stuff. They charge like $30 an hour. It takes about 60 hours, according to Google, to learn how to play the guitar. So you're going to pay $1,800 to somebody to learn how to play the guitar. Not to mention you have to buy the guitar and all the equipment and all that kind of stuff. You know, um, my guitar course is way, way cheaper than that. And I learned how to play the guitar online when I was a kid, when I was like four or five years old. Um, so if I could do it, you could do it. So if you want to check out my guitar course, it's in the description below. If you just want to learn how to play the guitar for yourself with all the worship songs you already know, or if you do want to be on your, your church's worship team, maybe there's a need there, or you just think that would be a cool thing to do. I was on my church's worship team for a very long time. It's, it's really fun. It's really awesome. It's, it's a great thing to be in church all day. It's one of my favorite things. So um, anyway, check out the guitar course. It's link is in the, in the description below. And I will see you guys in another video. Thank you for watching my tutorial. Have a good day. Don't know why I just saluted you. Let's do it again. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Okay.